ఎప్పుడెప్పుడు ఎదురు చూస్తున్నాం మన టెన్త్ కాన్వికేషన్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ టూ ఈరోజు రానే వచ్చింది Firstly, I would like to thank the administration and my faculty for their sincere hard work and efforts. It wouldn't be possible without them. We have many opportunities coming to BBA especially. We are involved in parts of live business projects, Kaizen Committee, Manogna Magazine. We do a lot of things that sum up our personality altogether. I should thank each and every faculty. All are very supportive, not just in terms of academics, but also they mentor us personally and guide us. I am Abdul Basit Hamid. I am from Sudan. I am studying BCA in IT department. I am very happy to be here today in Vignan University. When I came in 2019, that is time I feeling so that is, will be hard for me. So today I am very happy because I learned more from Vignan University, from faculty, from HUADISA, knowledge, even from lab, even HUADISA, even the respect. Respect is very important. Vignan University is a great.
Good evening to each one of you. It is my proud privilege and honor as a registrar of Vignan's University to extend a very warm welcome to the honorable chief guest of the 10th convocation today, Sri Nitin Gadgari ji, honorable minister of road transport and highways, government of India, guests of honor and recipients of honorary doctorate degrees in today's convocation, to begin with, Dr. Krishna M. Ella, Chairman and Managing Director of Bharat Biotech International Limited and a Padma Bhushan awardee, Sri Srikant Kidambi, Indian Badminton Player, Padma Shri awardee, Sri M. V. Reddy, Managing Director, Astra Microwave Products Limited, Hyderabad, Sri M. M. Kiravani, Music Director, Singer and Lyricist, Unfortunately, he is not with us today due to Hill Health. The Chancellor of Vignan's University, the Vice Chairman of Vignan Group of Institutions, Vice Chancellor, members of the Board of Management, members of the Academic Council, deans of faculties, heads of departments, distinguished guests, parents, media personnel, students, and most importantly, all the graduates receiving their degrees in today's convocation. Congratulations to all the graduates and a very warm welcome to each one of you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Jahin. I now declare the convocation open. Greetings to every one of you. Very happy celebration of the 10th convocation on this day of September 22. The pivotal star of the day, Sri N.J. Gadkari, Honorable Minister of Road Transport and Highways of Government of India, the esteemed Chancellor of the University, the respected Chairman Dr. Lavu Rattaya, a dreamer of higher echelon for higher education and the creator of Vignan, the illuminating galaxy of enthralling guests Dr. Krishna Yella, Sri Srikant Nammalwar Kidambi, Sri M. M. Kiravani in absentia and Sri M. V. Reddy, the sitting member of the Parliament representing Narasrao Pet constituency of Andhra Pradesh, Sri Krishna Devarayulu, the young man of action in the present and the hope of treasure for the future, the pillar members of the Board of Management, the Academic Council, the Finance Committee of the University, the highly decorated deans and heads of the disciplines of learning, the academic and research acumen of the university, the faculty, the custodian of the seal of the university, the registrar, the wheels of the university, the dedicated staff, the proud parents and family members of the graduates, a hearty welcome to all of you. The Vignan, in a future date, would profoundly recollect the glorious presence of the Honorable Minister Sri Gadkari ji in this 10th convocation, the gracious presence of Padma Bhushan Awardee Dr. Krishna Yalla, the timely life savior Superman, the creator of India's indigenous vaccine against COVID, the badminton prodigy Padma Shri Awardee Sri Srikant Nammalwar Kidambi, the multilingual music director, Sri M. M. Kiravani in absentia, the techno manager in the sophisticated domains of defense, space, and telecom, electronics, and communication engineering, Sri M. Venkatesh Vareddi, have been very inspiring for all of us and should be highly motivating for the graduates. The qualitative growth of Vignan is duly upheld by NIRF and NAC, a part of many other accrediting and ranking peers. Vignan, in spite of its presence in rural background, could carve itself to a height of 95th rank in NIRF under university category and 99th rank under engineering category. Its significant presence in the first 100 club 
should be noteworthy accomplishment. A warm welcome to all the dignitaries on the dais for the 10th convocation and all the dignitaries of the dais, uh, students, parents, uh, media, a warm welcome to one and all. Today's chief guest of the day, uh, Nitin Gadkari ji. Uh, you must have heard really great things about him, but uh, as a kid growing up in 90s, I have uh, seen so many people uh, going from uh, going from this district of Guntur to uh, uh, other countries like US and Germany and uh, Australia. When they come back, when they used to come back, they used to come back with the stories and uh, also with ch chocolates and everything. But the major story that they used to tell me, tell everyone here was how good the roads were there in uh, US and other countries. In the 90s, that's what the story is. But now, Watch by G has started uh, Golden Coordinator, then you have uh, taken it to the next level and uh, you are laying uh, to the tune of almost 90,000 kilometers of national highways. And he's not stopping there. He's also, he's not just a politician. He's an engineer and uh, he's a designer. He, he, he makes sure, he's a, he's a management guru, so he makes sure that everything falls into place. He's a multifaceted personality. He's not stopping there. He's going to the next level of talking about electronic vehicles. People in uh, Andhra, uh, although he's from uh, Tamil Nadu, but people in Andhra know him, uh, uh, know him very well for a long time. But now people all over the world know him very well because he has shown to India that uh, whatever we need to invent in India doesn't have to, uh, whatever we need in India doesn't have to come from other countries, but we can actually invent research and invent in India and we can give it to the world. Uh, other guest of the day, Venkatram Redigaru, uh, who is working in uh, defense space, telecom and uh, meteorology. Um, not many people might not be knowing him. He keeps a very low, low profile, but the work he's been doing is fantastic. Um, he has been, uh, he's instrumental in bringing down the radar technology we used to import from other countries. He brought down the radar technology from 900 crores for each radar to almost 200 crores. So another guest of the day, Kidambi Srikanth, uh, a young boy who saw Gopi Chand uh, Gopi Chandgaru traveling on the, on the open top jeep and he dreamt, so I also should do this. And, uh, by seeing that and he dreaming that on that day, he has become world number two in badminton. He's from Guntur, from local area. Shamam Kirwanigaru, who is not being present here because of his ill health. Uh, he is not just a lyricist, but he has given a lot of uh, big hits. Uh, you all know that at Bahubali and uh, people are and uh, what not. These are all these people are working multidisciplinary. They are not just being a biotechnologist. They are not being a, just being a politician. They are not just being a uh, musician. They are doing multiple things. That is where you, go, you have to go in the future years to come. So once again, I wish you all the best, all the best for your future, all the best for your uh, professional life, all the best for your uh, personal life as well. Thank you very much. Honorable Chancellor, Dr. Lau Vethian, Mr. Lau Sri Krishna Rivarapalu, Honorable MP, Professor P. Nagabhushan, Dr. Krishna Ilai, MD, Bharat Biotech. First of all, I am giving my all best wishes to all of you, particularly the students who are receiving degrees. I remembering when I was a university student, I got the degree, I remember my happiness of that day. So really it is a great day for all of you. My all best wishes with you. God bless you. The Prime Minister's dream is to make Indian economy of 5 trillion dollar. And at the same time, we want to make Atmanirbhar Bharat. And for that reason, the two important philosophy which always I am telling to the people, the one is innovation, entrepreneurship, science, technology, research, skill and successful practices. We name it as knowledge. And conversion of knowledge into wealth is the future that no material is waste and no person is waste. It is depending upon the appropriate technology, it is depending upon the appropriate leadership and the vision of the leadership that you can convert waste into wealth. I am not an intelligent student, neither I am an engineer. There is a misimpression in the mind of the people that I am an engineer. The whole world is recognizing our engineers, our doctors. The USA, the European countries, everywhere, Indian talent is well recognized and respected. And that is one of the reasons that we have the highest young talented engineering manpower in India, like you. No kri maangne wale mat bano. No kri dene wale bano. I am really happy. I am giving you best wishes. Me andar ki na rudhe purvak asi sulu. Barabar huna me. So my best wishes to all of you. God bless you. Thank you very much. Namaskar. Bharat Mata Ki Jai.
award is being conferred upon Dr. Krishna Yalla in recognition of a distinguished research career and devoted service to the public health care in the nation. When I was a, from a village, small village, my primary school was one mile away. The high school, 10 miles away. The university was 100 miles away. But the University of Vignan has come to village. I think that's the greatness of the Vignan. Come there to you, your root place, village, where the village can prosper. The minister spoke very simple things. Innovation and entrepreneurship. I'll only say a few words. What is innovation? Nobody teaches in the classroom about innovation. No ideas are taught in the classroom. It is all you see, observe. That is what is it. Entrepreneurship is not to make money. Entrepreneurship is to solve some society problem. You solve any society problem that comes automatically, money comes along with it. You don't go behind money. When I was giving at the University of Wisconsin, my keynote speech there, the honorary doctorate there at Wisconsin, I told the same thing to students, don't go behind money. You just go with an idea of solving any society problem, whether Guntur village problem or anybody problem. You solve some problem, you'll become an entrepreneur and you make a good society, the money comes as a byproduct of it. That is the only message I'll give you, don't go behind money, solve society problem. That becomes an entrepreneurship and I'm really proud that Vignan is right in Guntur, helping a lot of rural kids, that's what is impressing. This award is being conferred upon Sri Srikanth Kidambi for his ongoing dedication to the world of sports. I request all of you to please rise and give a standing ovation. Good evening everyone. I'm very honored to be part of, uh, to be on this dais today among such great personalities. Uh, so I was telling uh, Rathay Garu, for 20 years back, uh, there used to be a school in Lakshmipuram, Vignan School. And uh, I was part of it exactly 20 years back. And uh, today I'm here receiving the honorary doctorate. I'm just happy if I look back 20 years. Uh, it just gives me a lot of memories. And I'm here. Uh, I'm meant to say something to you, but uh, all of you are already engineers and uh, do you think is there something that engineers can't do? But for me, I've been a player, I've been a badminton player for last 20 years or maybe more, maybe 21, 22. Uh, I've learned a lot of life lessons and uh, most of which are uh, through badminton and all that I want to tell you is that there will definitely be a lot of downs in your career. There will not be somebody to cheer you up, somebody to give you a hand every time you are down. It's you that you have to push yourself and uh, it's you that you have to love what you are doing. You know, I think all of you are well educated, I think you have the best uh, infrastructure here. I think you have the right set of uh, skills and education. It's just that how you use them is more important. And uh, you people are the future of India. It's my privilege and honor to present the citation of Doctor of Science Hanadi Skaja, Sri M. Vengadeshwar Redigaru. Chairman of uh, Vignan Group, uh, Dr. Lau Rathaygaru, Vice Chairman of uh, BFSRT, and uh, Member of Parliament, Dr. Uh, Krishna Garu, and Vice Chancellor of BFSDR, Professor Naubushan Garu, and uh, all other dignitaries on the dais, of the dais. Today, India means the opportunities for youth. In the current scenario, as uh, Honorable Minister uh, just now mentioned, the kind of infrastructure in place, the kind of policies which are already implemented, all graduates, various disciplines will have ample opportunities. Make in India, 
is already proving and many industries including startups are flourishing you know the most of the students are you know looking for a short term objective than long term growth that is just i wanted all of you to be just careful please focus on long term growth not short term objective in fact i have seen many cases like you know uh, students ran after a software job for a short term objective but they lost out in a long term i'm not saying that not to pursue software job but uh, the only thing is you should focus on the long term growth before i conclude i take this opportunity uh, to thank my parents and my family members especially my wife she she was behind me throughout my 33 years of professional life and she took the entire family responsibility on her shoulders and she gave me a lot of time to work for a profession thank you very much for this opportunity being given thank you jai hind born into a conservative telugu family of music lovers in kovuru village of west godavari Sri Kinawani embarked on his musical career with his first assignment for the Malayalam composer Sri C Rajamani in 1987 later in the same year he worked with the Telugu composer Sri K Chakravarti for a year or so he was under the mentorship of veteran lyricist Sri Veturi Sundar Ramurthy known as Kinawani to Telugu audience as Marakatamani to Tamil audience and as mm cream to the hindi audience he has accomplished himself in multiple languages for his exemplary service and contribution to the field of fine arts and music he is taking this award in absentia i confer upon you the honorary degree of this university and in token thereof you have been presented with the diploma and i, and I authorize you to wear the robes ordained as the insignia of your degree thank you the chief guest of the day nitin gadkari garu who uh, is a great political leader uh, the guest of honor respected uh, krishna ella garu i got a lot of respects for him uh, padma vachana award and also popularly known as vaccine man of india the other guest of honor uh, respected m a reddy garu who has contributed a lot for the development of uh, space research of this country the guntur boy a proud of all the guntur not only guntur for entire andhra pradesh and telangana prasad reddy garu sarath garu and other people and vice chancellor and the deans faculty members and respected uh, parents uh, and my dear students i welcome you all to the 10th convocation when we observe the ceos and the top people of uh, fortune 500 companies indian is the ceo that is how the power of the indian brain is uh, exhibited all over the world especially in america where which is a very competitive society so this is these are the opportunities for you and but at the same time you should be attentive to, to observe the transformation i hope and i wish that you are going to do well in your future and after 5 10 years after becoming the leaders like sudhakar yeah all of you should come to me yes make me feel proud of you thank you wish you all the best once again uh, i thank uh, krishna lagaru emirati garu and uh, srikanth garu for their uh, uh, for their gesture and their inspiring presence with us thank you thank you very much